The people I see on the roads look like they've basically come out of basic rider courses, where you're in a parking lot for, I'd say, 15 to 35 miles an hour. Swerving in 15 miles an hour isn't the same as, oh, I'm gonna hit somebody and I've gotta swerve at 65 miles an hour. Not real life skills that you're gonna encounter on the street. The amount of people that are dying because of motorcycle accidents, just sole accidents from themselves, isn't surprising because they've only gone through basic rider courses. It's not real world, every day, out there riding in traffic or with obstacles coming at you. You've got dogs, you've got kids running across the street, you've got things that you have to avoid. The track training helped because obviously you're at higher speeds. You really have to have major awareness of things around you. You've got to decide, oh, is that rider in front of me going to be in my line? And if they are, you've got to slow down. Everything becomes almost automatic. So by the time you get on the street, everything seems kind of slow. And you actually have time to react because we're teaching you the skills here to react. I think people think that track days are too expensive and honestly they aren't when you consider the fact that it is an investment in yourself and you know you have to think about the people that are involved your families your loved ones they're worried about you know your skills out there too so they want to see you live another day go to work on Monday and quite honestly I think these types of events are seriously saving people's lives.